Okay, so let's say you just downloaded Blender and you know that you can use Python with Blender, but you're trying to use Pandas within Blender and that's not working for you. So if you go into the console, let's go ahead and import Pandas as PV, go ahead and click enter. No module, it does not come there. What you need to do in order to fix this is you need to create an environment within your Anaconda space that matches the Python distribution from uh, from Blender. So you can see here, it's got a 353. So we need to make that environment and then we have to go ahead and install the packages you want to be able to use within here in that environment. So let's go ahead and do that. First thing you want to do is locate where your Python storage or Python is stored for Blender. So I installed mine on my D drive. It's in this Blender folder and version 2.79 is the latest version from their website. And there's going to be a folder in here called Python and scripts and data frame. Python right here, this is what it's referencing. Uh, this is where the packages are going to be stored. The first thing you want to do is just go ahead and add, uh, let's add some lines in front. And what this does is it changes the reference so that it no longer references uh, this location because it's looking for a folder named Python and it no longer sees that. The next thing you want to do is we want to go ahead and bring up an Anaconda prompt. And what we're going to be doing first is creating an environment. So what we want to do here is, I wrote this down, is we need to do conda create a new environment. And we're going to be calling it Blender. And this is the key point right here. We want to create a Python 3.50 environment. So I tried it where I created a 3.5.3 environment, but that was giving me a bunch of errors. So switching back to 3.5.0 solves the major issues that you've probably uh, seen if you've tried this method before. So we're going to go ahead and create that. Let's go ahead and run that. Oh, sorry, already ran that. Let's go ahead and go to... So you can navigate to your environments by going to the Anaconda, Environments, uh, and then let's just go here. I'm going to go ahead and delete my Blender folder out. I prepped this beforehand. Let's go ahead and close this. Okay, so that folder's blank. Go ahead and run that. Solving. Let's speed this up. Okay, we're back. So now this is created. We go ahead and type in activate. And then let's type the name Blender. Awesome, so you'll see the Blender name is here. We now have access to that. Now the next thing we need to do is bring up a second Anaconda prompt. And we're going to CD, well actually I need to go to my D drive first, and then we're going to CD into the location where the Python is stored for Blender. Ugh. Sorry. And then we're going to, from here, we need to link to our environment. So I have this bit of code over here. And what that'll do, as you'll see here, creates this link. It's a Python folder that links to your environment so that you can go ahead and operate in this environment here, install whatever packages you want, and have them accessible here. So let's go ahead and do a pip install numpy. And then uh, let's do a pip install pandas right after. Pip install Pandas. Awesome, so they've both installed now, and now we can go ahead and pop open our Blender. Exit out of that, let's go to our Python console, let's do import num numpy as mp, that worked, as pd, and that worked as well. So we're good there. So let me know if you guys have any questions or comments below. Thank you guys for watching.